Hello, hello. Welcome back for episode six of Suikoden 2. Let's get right to it. Last time we were head over heels about our mighty warrior Shiro. And I think we were back on our way to Muse. I think we stopped right outside of it to get ready to come back inside. Um, yeah, okay. So, Jowie didn't catch up with us. What should we do? Should we go see Jess? I would say so. Alright, City Hall was straight up. And don't let me forget to sell my crap. And who's in the storeroom back here? You're not Jess. There's an important meeting today. You can't go in. Um... Well, I need to. Hmm. Guess we'll go back to the bar. We can't see Jess or Annabelle. What are we going to do? Are Victor's and the others here? Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. We'll get some help from our allies. What's going on? You okay? Leona told us what was going on. We've been very worried. Yeah, I'm okay, but Jowie. Yeah, he's not here. What happened to him? Well, you see, what had happened was. So they've captured Jowie? Well, I don't know. Jowie said he'd follow after us. What's scaring him going to do? Hey, let's go see Jess and find out exactly what's going on. But Jess isn't there, and we weren't allowed to see Annabelle. Don't worry, I'll show you a good trick. Yay! Got our Giga Lords back. Alright, Victor, what you got up your sleeve? Probably gonna knock the shit out of the dude guarding the door. I know Victor. <laughs> and I slightly do. What's your business here? Lady Annabelle's preparing for a meeting. Oh, yep, yeah, there we go. Good trick, huh? It's the best way to deal with government workers. Let's go in. Jesus, man. What is this? Victor and Flick, what happened? Why do you look so angry? Hey, you, is it true that you sent those two to sneak into the Highland camp? Hold on a minute, don't get so mad. Yes, I asked them to do it, now get your hands off me. Annabelle, I don't know you that well, but is the state really in such bad shape that they have to use kids like this as spies? I asked them because in order to defeat the Highland army, we need to know how much provisions they have. How many did they have, anyways? Is that all you? The important thing is Jowie. What about Jowie? Been captured by Highland. Well, I don't know if he's captured, but he didn't come back. So please save him. Thanks for getting information for us. And sorry for putting him in danger. I'm afraid we can't save him. We've got our hands full just protecting the city. Forgive me. Standing around and talking isn't going to bring him back. Um. Alright, Victor, that's enough. I guess mercs like us don't have anything to say about what goes on here. Let's go back. I got scum, for real. We've been there. Wonder if he's okay. I'm sure he's fine. He'll come back. Yeah, he'll be fine. You're right. Well, I'm gonna wait for him by the gate. All 
Alright. I'm gonna go out with the gate with her. Gawi's not back yet. I'm going to wait a little longer for him. Why don't you go back to Leona's and rest? If he comes back, I'll tell you. Um, I'm gonna wait with you. That'd be nice. It'll seem faster that way. No, I guess not. It's late. You should go wait at Leona's. Uh, I'm not leaving you out here by yourself. Aw, Pilika came outside to wait with us. Remember the time we got lost in Lude Woods? A oh, grandpa was out looking for you. Jowie and I waited just like this. He came back and I know he's going to too. I think you should wait at Leona's after all. You'll catch cold. Why is she so adamant that we leave? Well, while we were waiting for you just like this, you know what Jowie did? He cried the whole time. Can you believe it? Him crying just like a little baby? Hey, this conversation is our secret, okay? I promised him I would never tell a soul. Looks like Pilico is pretty tired. It's late. Hey. You know what I think? When he comes back, let's go far away from here. And there he is. Kept his promise. Welcome home. Nice having people to wait for you. I like I waited too. Thanks. Hey, how long are you two gonna sleep? A little longer, you know I hate mornings. Come on. I know it was rough, but it's already been a week. Snap out of it. Come on, come on, let's go. Let's go? Where? Something's about to start at Jalston Hill. People have come from here from all over the place. Is it a festival? Maybe something like that. Come on, let's go see. Oh well. Shall we? Let's do it. I don't get out of here. Uh, I'm lost. <laughs> um, oh, okay, 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 okay. Right, let's look around. I want to just go to Justin Hill, right? Um,. Hey, aren't we going to Justin Hill? Come on, can we go, please? What is it? You have to use the bathroom? What does she want? Isn't that where we're going? I guess... Oh! It's probably that place up there in the corner that we couldn't get into before. Are we allowed to have more party members? Okay. 
Guess not. Alright, so let's go sell our junk real quick. Welcome. Welcome, Millions Armor Emporium. What may I do for you? Um... Let's sell... All this crap. Brass armor wasn't worth anything anymore. Shoulder pads, we'll just sell them for monies. Oh yeah, what was this fire ceiling thing? Void fire, water damage times two. Huh. Okay. Oh wait, let's see if they got any new rare finds. Nah, still just a pointed hat. Okay. Alright. Up to the corner. That's where we shall go. Also, let me try and fix something in emulation, the emulation real quick. Okay, never mind. I was trying to improve the picture a little bit. On the recording, it's like in a tiny little square. Um, but I'll just have to go into Resolve Studio and fix it later, like after the, the recording. I think it does that because that's the actual size of the emulator, like its, it's internal resolution. So it makes like a giant black box around everything else. And you can make it like fit the screen in the recording, but then it's all stretched out and just doesn't look good. Victor, what is this? Huh? It's a meeting of the leaders of the city state of Jowston. This is Jowston Hill. So they call this the Hilltop Conference. Leaders of the five state cities Muse, South Window, Green Hill, the Matilda Knights, and oh, I forget. Anyway, it should be interesting. Interesting. It's okay, don't worry. You can get in if you stick with me. You should see it. It'll be something to tell your grandkids, I'm sure. Only concerned parties are allowed. I'm Victor, mercenary leader under contract by Muse City, vampire slater extraordinaire. You know, I helped um, save an entire kingdom. You know, let me in. Wait a minute, show me some proof of identity. Hey, you don't recognize my face? My face is proof of my identity. Sorry, but I can't let you in. What? Hope you're not planning on using your good trick again. Who's this? Oh, you... Are you really Sir Flick? Yeah, but... You're the mercenary soldier, the one... The one they call Flick of the Blue Lightning. Please, please go in. How come they don't know my face, but they know yours? <laughs> I guess he wears a cape. The room's very stately. Mayor of Muse City, Lady Annabelle. We're going to do our sightseeing over there. And let me just get something real quick to my note. Okay, sorry about that. Out of the way, girl. You creep. What are you doing? Pardon us, my lady. I believe he was over-eager. May we have your forgiveness? No. I mean, yes. <laughs> what are you doing, Camille? Just doing my job as a knight. Got a problem? That is good. Well, please excuse me. It's hurry. It's also a knight's job to be on time. Called me lady. <laughs> She's a little smitten, huh? Leader of the Matilda Knights and the White Knights, Lord Gerudo. Representative General of Two River City, Lord Mackay. 
Acting Mayor of Green Hill City, Lady Teresa. And Mayor of Tento City, Lord Gustav. Oh, there's another one. Mayor of South Window City, Lord Grand Mayor. Iyer? Whatever. Commander of the Mew City Forces, Lord Hauser. Oh, falling asleep to all these names. In accordance with the Jalston State Agreement, I hereby begin the Hilltop Conference. The Highland Army is massed at our border. They have only two weeks' provisions with them. We'll believe, we believe they'll attack soon. Wait a moment. Are they still in compliance with the peace agreement? The Highland Army has already invaded the eastern part of Meuse and burned several villages to the ground along the way. As for that, didn't Highland reply that that was a trick by mountain bandits? Do you really believe that Victor's mercenary army could be crushed by a group of mountain bandits? You can't deny that the Highland Army is massed at the border. It is a fact, and this represents a threat to the city-state. Highland Army has approached the border before, and they'd never truly attacked. Why should this be any different? The commander of the Highland Army has changed from Agris Blight to his son, Prince Luca Blight. That's why things are different. He knows. Oh, so you can't pay your annual rice offering for three years, but your mouth still works fine, I see. How dare you. It is just as Lord Gustav said. They'll run at the first sign of battle. I'm certainly not going to expend my nights for this. The people of Two River are also tired from many battles. Luca Blight is more demon than man. If he breaks through Muse's defenses, the state will be in shambles. In the name of our mutual oath, I order you to provide troops to protect Muse City, capital city of the city-state Jouston. I'm not afraid of your threats. What good is it if I protect Muse and my people, the people of Tinto, starve? That's an order in the name of the state. You should watch how you speak, Lord Gustav. Excuse me. Of news to report, the Highland Army has slaughtered our border guards and they're reportedly heading for Muse. What? It appears they were serious. No shit. You all heard. I'm ordering all of you to gather your armies. Alright, which one of them is the traitor? Okay, let's go back. Some of them were quite hesitant to uh, act against these guys. It's a little sus. It's a little bit. I mean, I don't know, maybe they were just trying to like make them look older and practical. You should have a good nose for these things, though. That was pretty interesting, huh? You think so? Looked like just a bunch of old men talking to me. <laughs> I guess you're right. Man, I'm tired out from just sitting in there. Let's head to Leona's place. Hey, not that. Duck. Alright. Um, that's not Leona's. Crap, I went the wrong way. Hey, what a surprise. I was watching the meeting too. It was rough, but you did well. Well, it's part of my job. Nobody's giving full cooperation, but nobody wants anyone destroyed by Highland either. So what is it? You didn't come here to make small talk. Victor, I need you to somehow slow down the Highland army. It will take seven days to gather all of the state forces. The Highland army will arrive in five days. Two days will be enough. Buy us two days. Two days? We battle outside Muse and maybe bloody their noses a little. Yeah, I think I can buy you two days. <clears throat> Sorry. They'll never change. They ask for crazy things like they're nothing. The idea of us alone trying to stop Luca Blight? Counting on you, Victor. Also, we'll be expecting reinforcements from the Matilda Knights to arrive early. Well, if it's just slowing them down, I think I can handle it. Thanks, handsome. <laughs> well, uh, hey, that's my job. Plus, if it's a request from a fine lady like you, I could never refuse. 
Please let us fight with you. It was wrong of me to get you guys involved in this whole mess. Forgive me. You don't need to do any more than you already have. This is a problem for adults. No. We want to fight. We'll help you slow down the, the Highland Army. You'll fight too, won't you? Uh, yeah, of course I will. Don't get yourself killed. When the battle is over, come back and visit me. I'll tell you all about Master Genkaku. Okay. Well, I've got to get back. Victor, do a good job for us. I know you will. Yeah, well, you're right. One's meeting outside. Already awake. Actually, I couldn't sleep. All right, stairs are right here. <laughs> the Highland Army advance forces are close. If we can beat them, we'll have done our job. Our job isn't to defeat the entire Highland Army. If we can slow them down, it'll be enough. But remember, if we don't protect Mews and it falls to Highland, it's all over. Give it all you've got. Everyone, gird yourselves for battle. We'll go when preparations are complete. Um, we should probably save. Um, all right. We have saved. Now, anything else we need to do in here? Wait, we need to get a party together. Luck. I guess not. I guess it's gonna be another one of the the um, overland battles, probably. Um, okay, do I talk to uh, Victor and Flick or something? Hey, are you all ready? Yes. Good, we're just about ready. You can see the Highland Army's advanced troops. It's that guy, Victor, again. This time I'll kick his ass. <laughs> Don't worry, all we got to do is slow them down. We can defeat Solange's unit, or buy enough time, they should retreat. Alright. Why? Are you used to command yet? We've given you two state reinforcement units to command. Good luck. We got us... These two, who's this? Gilbert? What's wrong? Put the cursor on a unit and select it. Don't forget to give orders to your state army allies too. Yeah, I was looking at stuff. Okay. Guy looks the strongest for sure. And their troops are better than ours. I know, I know, I know, I know. No, okay, chill out. Um, let's see. Stop it. <laughs> I'm thinking. Dang it. So uh, let's bring these guys over. They only move one at a time. That's a little rough. Hey, Flick, see someone you recognize? Gilbert, is it? I can't believe he's working for Highland. Do you know him? If only you could get him to switch sides. We've lost your touch. Why, you worthless. I'll build, uh, how about it, Gilbert? Why don't you join our side? A proud warrior like you shouldn't take money from scum like Luca Blight. 
I guess this is fate. Okay, I'll do it. Oh wow, he literally just changed sides on the fly. Pretty funny. Um, well, shoot, I can't actually get up there. Let's have you go up, and then you go over, and then we can have you just wait. You can't move because everyone else is in the freaking way. I am Miklatov, captain of the Blue Knights of Matilda. I'm here to assist Sir Victor. Cool. I thought the fire spares were broken. Victor, can you move your butt out of the way? Oh boy. Oh, they didn't attack him. Dang, Calvary destroyed the footman. Which, I mean, checks out. Uh Crazy man. Alright. Can I do bright shield? Repair self? Critical. Okay. Guess we should get up here and heal this dude. Maybe? I don't know. These men are getting kind of decimated. Rest in pepperonis. Ouch. Lord, your, if your unit is damaged, move it back to the village. Units on top of towns or castles have their damage repaired. Oh, okay. Kind yeah, of cool. Archers. It's getting wrecked. That's it. Fall back. Okay. Guess he... I don't know. Did he live or die? Who <laughs> knew? Oh my god. Can't be. The fight isn't over yet. Wow. That was a lot of damage. Um, attack these fools. Uh, I guess you're stuck here, huh? Oof. That unit's going. Rest in pepperonis, my friends. Thank you. 
All right. Oh, I see. The little sword in them means they've been hurt. Oh, you can, like, automate your... Your, uh... Turn to Apple, I guess? Kind of funny. Miklatov, Commander Gordo orders us to withdraw our forces immediately. What are you saying? Our knights should turn our backs on the enemy and run? The knight's duty to follow the orders of his liege. Have you forgotten your oath? There they go. What's the matter with them? They're not going to defend Muse? Looks like someone is up to some nasty tricks here. Muse falls. Next will be your necks on the line. Oh god, is Jowie the traitor? I swear to god, dude, if he betrays us, I'm gonna be so pissed off. Yippee! We're getting wrecked. A glorious day. Get him. Ha! Huh. Today was just a greeting. Tomorrow your head will be decorating the walls of this city. Well, I'll try it if you've got the guts. Oh, they're leaving too? What the heck? Somehow we managed to slow them down. That's weird. We all fought well, and everyone gets some rest. Strangeness. Hey, can I tell you something? Sure. Thanks. Well, about this battle, do you... Uh, forget about it. There's no choice, I guess. We have to protect ourselves. Good night. Tell them just like that. I understand. It'll be just as you order. Oh no, Jowie, no! Come on, dude. Silica, don't worry, it's just the wind. Hurry up and get to sleep. I I hope I'm taking the right path. Maybe he's not a spy. Maybe he's like a double agent. That's what I'm going to choose to believe. <laughs> I'm going to pre pretend that he's pretending to be a spy for, for Highland while secretly working for us. But just in case, I'm going to take up all his stuff, too. <laughs> just in case. Nothing personal, Jowie, but, uh... Well, you know. Oh, you're both awake. I'm here, too. Oh, sorry, sorry. You're going to see Annabelle today, aren't you? Tell her what a great job I did, okay? Who did a great job? Ha 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 ha. That's right. Anyway, don't go outside of the city. The Highland Army is all around. Okay, let's go. Don't you want to hear about Master? Not really. <laughs> You're really asking me. <laughs> I don't care nothing about some old dead fool that I have no connection to or emotional attachment with. My character does, I guess, but... Anyways, I'm taking this from you, because you are sus. Another Fury? Hmm... Should I get that for someone else? I don't know. Back up for Tuned Sword. Versus one column, defense is zero for spears. I guess we should get Titan. That's right. 
We need to swap that thingy off of, uh... Ah, uh, but we don't have... We don't have him in our party. Okay. Well, I guess we're waiting. But we've got it at least now. Guess we're going back to City Hall. Lord Gustav, are you saying that Tento City will not cooperate? That's not what I'm saying. But as long as we don't know the Highland Army's intentions, I'm not going to commit my troops. I think their intentions are clear. Perhaps you're just frightened. How dare you? It was the South Window Army who retreated at the first sight of blood during the Scarlet Moon Empire War. You're a fool. War isn't a gambling game. Stop it, the both of you. It's no use arguing. In any case, we're not ready to commit troops. That's my decision. Forgive me. As you can see, we're in the middle of negotiations. Could you come back this evening? Yes, of course. Let's go. Lady Annabelle, may I ask you something? What is it? Why are you fighting? What do you hope to get from this war? I'll get nothing from it. I fight so we won't lose. I was born in Muse. Raised in Muse. It's natural that I want to protect her. It was still debating. Well, she's busy, so let's go. That was fast. Didn't you get to see Annabelle? We saw her, but she told us to come back at night. She was really busy. It looked like she was arguing about something. Yeah, well, that figures. She hasn't really seen with her own eyes how scary Blight is. Nanami, could you play with Pilika for a little while? Huh? What? Sure I can, but what's up? Over here, come play with me. I'm sorry, Pelico. Oh no. Oh no. There's still some time before evening, why don't you get some rest? Uh, yeah, I'm a little worried about Joey. Okay. He isn't mad at you. It's okay, it'll be alright. Man, I wish Felica could talk so she could tell us what's happening. Let's go see if we can figure out where this brat ran off to. We probably want to go talk to Annabelle again. See you later. Mm, should we let him know that we saw him talking to someone? Yeah, we're going to be upfront with him. Who was that person? I'm sorry, I can't say right now. The war isn't going to end for a long time. You and Anami should run far away. What are you going to do? If I was ever killed, I want you to take care of Pilica. Huh. Who is that? Who's rude enough to come knocking this time of night? Hey, were you awake? 
I don't have time to sleep. In that case, how about we have a little drink? Sounds nice. <laughs> Alright, Victor. I think you'll like this. It's from Kanakon to the south. I saved this one just to drink with you. When my fort burned down, this one bottle was all I could carry. Hmm. Nice bouquet. So how is it? Don't stare at me like that. I feel like you're looking right into my heart. Sorry, just a bad habit of mine. That's right. You're a tough one. The people of this city are sleeping peacefully now. The flames of war are coming here soon. Even if we gather all the state troops, I wonder what chance we'll have when we've come face to face with Luke Luke of Light's army. Well, about 50-50, I guess. I can't. I mean, we can't lose. If we lose, we lose everything. All of those lives. When I think about it, sometimes I get so sad, I even think that maybe we should just surrender quietly. A leader can't think that way. Everyone's fighting as hard as they can. They all have something they want to defend. You do too. Even if it's to save your life, there are some things you just don't do. At least that's the way I see it. I need all my strength tomorrow. After this drink, I'm gonna get to bed. Lack of sleep makes you weak. Say, I was born in a different time, different place. If I was a little shorter, <laughs> I might have been a good girlfriend for you, huh? <laughs> well, you're just fine the way you are if you ask me. Maybe I'm not, though. Aw, oh, that's cute. You're a fine, well-bred lady. <laughs> that's right, they used to say shit like that. Me, you couldn't be seen with me. Anyway, see you tomorrow. Welcome back. We were waiting for you. Let's go see Annabelle soon, okay? What is it, Pelica? Oh, Jowie? It's strange. I haven't seen him. There's nothing to worry about. He came home before, like he promised. Besides, uh, we'll be back soon, so be a good girl, okay? Let's go. I got a bad feeling about this. Oh wait, that's not City Hall. Wait, does she sleep in City Hall? Oh, I guess we're going to see her, so she wouldn't be asleep anyways. We see, uh, we came to see Annabelle. Yeah, I heard. Annabelle is in her private room down the hall. Your friend is already back there. Oh, okay. Shall we come to see her, I guess? Uh-oh. Is that you? Come in. Excuse me, Annabelle, may I come in? Please, uh, but Chowie, what do you want at this hour? Your life. I came to take it. I knew it. This little rat bastard. You're not joking, are you? Please, don't scream. I don't want to believe it, but... Forgive me. Why is he wanting to kill her? Is he trying to just quietly hand over the city? Uh, to protect Muse and the state. To allow the people here to live rich, full lives. That is what I must do. You have something like that? Something you'll do at all costs? Yes, I also have something I must do. Can you bear the burden, Jowie? Do you really have the resolve? Yes, I've got a reason to bear that burden. And I will. Even if I call for help, I suppose I can't stop that knife. Would you at least let me finish this glass? I'm a close friend. I'd be sad to waste it. 
I'm sorry. You dropped your guard, boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh no. Hope she's not dead. Oh no. Lady Annabelle, the Highland Army has made a surprise night attack. What the? Yeah, yeah, we didn't do shit. Lord Jess, the Highland Army has entered the city. How could that have happened so quickly? It was open from the inside. Someone must be working with them. Uh, yeah, get a doctor ASAP. Is she gonna die? Try not to talk. Tell Jess, I don't need a doctor. Then Kaku's son, I meant to apologize to you for what the state and I did to Genkaku. Were you happy with your life with Genkaku? Yes. Dang. She's gonna die. Her last request is for us to live. Yeah, let's run. We well, gotta go get everyone else, though. That's right, Pilico. We have to say Pilico. Yeah, same brand, son. <laughs> oh crap! There's actually soldiers here. All right. Nice. And I'll do no damage. Crazy Nanami. Victor and Flick went to gather the army to try and buy a little time. They're going to all rendezvous in South Window. I'm getting ready to get out of here. You should escape too. A boat runs from Coronet, south of here, to South Window. What are you waiting for? Hurry up and run. Alright, let's do it. Get the heydays out of here. Can I take other people with me? No. Oh. Yeah. In that case, let's run. I can't believe Jolly betrayed us. Whatever his reasons were, it was just really messed up. Hope we get to kill him later. <laughs> Is that messed up to say? I don't care what his reasons were. He just murdered someone in cold blood. If we made it this far, we should be fine. How many times have we run like this? Wait, Pelico, we can't go back. It's okay. Can't go back. Yeah, we will not be fine. I guess we're going to kill him ourselves. We finally fell asleep. Hey. Is it true?
true? Did he really do that to Annabelle? All right, well, you live in your delusions, Nanami. He actually did. You know what I want? I want to go somewhere far away. Far away from all this war. Somewhere in the mountains, maybe. We could live a quiet life. We could farm a small field, just the three of us. That'd be nice. Sorry, you're right. That will never happen now. All right, I'm going to sleep. morning. Leona, she said to go to Coronet, right? Good morning, Pelico. We'll go after you wash your face. Hey, you go wash your face at that stream, too. All right, there's Coronet. I don't think we can save here, but... That's all right. I'm gonna head and stop the video here and call it an evening and go make doodles of Jowie and burn them in fires. <laughs> no, but seriously, thanks for hanging out and I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day or evening and I'll see you next time.